And so you mentioned we got to go backwards and almost reverse engineer the disease and then we can treat it if we know the causes. So what, what are the causes? Well, I say walk it backwards. And I actually wrote uh, a big article in my newsletter about that uh, a short time ago. But, um, you know, when your oncologist doesn't know, and he talks about genes and genomes, and we know that the, the big genome study that uh, Bill Clinton said would be the answer to cancer and every sickness and disease known to man is largely a fraud. And, and you're not going to find the answers there. But we still need to understand why we have this sickness or disease. You know, a lot of people don't even call it a disease because it's just a, it's just a, a series of symptoms that your body is telling you that something is wrong and that, that needs to be dealt with. Actually, in the final analysis, it, it's your body's last gap, gasp to try and save itself is what it truly is. So I say, if you, here's the deal. This, cancer is caused by chemicals and radiation. You can explode that out to many different types of chemicals, whether it's what you put on your body, what you breathe, um, what you eat, uh, radiation from all sources, women from mammograms, uh, from CT scans, from your cell uh, phones, your cell towers, your Wi-Fi. Cancer is caused by chemicals and radiation, period. Don't we find it odd then that we treat a disease that's caused by chemicals and radiation with chemicals and radiation? It, it's a fraud. And, and there's no other way to put it. It's just a fraud. So we walk it backwards. Okay, chemicals and radiation. All right, let's get the chemicals and radiation out. First thing you got to do. So in my book, I tell people not only what to do, but what to stop doing. And, and it's critical. We need to detox the body. We need to drink the right fluids and eat the right foods and take the right supplements. And I'll talk about this uh, more tomorrow at the convention here. But we, we need to do the things that actually build the human immune system, which is essentially, as you know, the only thing that heals cancer or anything else. We see people talking all the time. You and I probably know 400 different uh, cures for cancer that people say has cured their cancer. We hear new ones all the time. And it may well have worked for that person. But you know what? If you don't break it down to the, the fundamentals, that, that walking it backwards and break it down to the fundamentals, your chances of healing go down exponentially. You have to do that. So walking it backwards is just a, a, a way of saying that, folks, we need to know that what, what prevents cancer also brings about the curing of cancer. And what brings about the curing of cancer, or again, we say the human immune system, the healing of the human immune system, um, also prevents cancer. So it, it's not that complicated. As a matter of fact, it's so simple that way too many people miss it. Mm. They want the pill. We're Americans. We live our lives the way we want. Don't get in my way, whatever you do. And when we get to be 50 or 60, sometimes much less now, and we have cancer, we think that the doctor, who is just revered slightly below God in our, in our uh, society today, is going to be able to give us the pill to heal us. We just don't understand that, that that's not the case. There is no pill, folks save for these fundamentals, which will heal cancer almost every single time if you know what to do. Mm. The pill for every ill is what we have today. Yeah, it is.